I'm Chelsea Wharton, and I'm reading for Lucy. I am Andy Wharton, and I'm speaking for Isaac. No, Aiden. Aiden. <laughs> oh boy. Aiden. Have you been reading that one, Lucy? Yes. Wait, Andy, have you read that one upstairs? I have, yeah. Okay. <laughs> oh, oh, boy. Boy. Okay, okay, that shit's funnier. <laughs> Haven't you ever heard of knocking? I tried. In the last minute and a half, I, I thought maybe you had your headphones on. No, I'm just tired. Um, shouldn't you be asleep? I don't know. I'm thinking about taking a coffee drinking. No, no, no caffeine for you, Lucy Gray. <laughs> <laughs> How are you feeling? <laughs> uh, I'm okay, I think. I don't know, it's just, he was so close today, you know? We were in his little room, we stood over his bed. I mean, it's almost like mom and dad were bringing us back together, you know? It's almost too perfect. Lou. Now, Aiden, I know you're about to tell me not to get my hopes up and that I shouldn't get ahead of myself because I'll just wind up disappointed. Don't worry, I'm a big girl. I'm, I'll be fine. Okay, mind reader, so if you're so smart, what else was I gonna say? Um, that lovely. <laughs> yeah, that too. Just. Be careful, Lucy, okay? I will, I will. How are you doing? I'm... hungry. <laughs> really? Really? You're hungry? After everything that happened today, you're hungry? What, should I stop eating? Yes. You should take a vow of hunger and of poverty. Then you can donate your stuff to poor, impoverished me. Tell you what, I will take vows of hunger and poverty the day you take vow of silence. Well, Lucy can't talk. I guess she can't hold me to my promise. <laughs> <laughs> See you at the surface. <laughs> See you on Jupiter. Good night. Good night.